Oh my god, almost dropped to my face. Good morning guys, so I just had my breakfast and like I promised, the first thing I'm gonna show you today is what I did my makeup with, aka what I have in my travel makeup bag. So, okay, to start with, all the things are here. Start with, for the primer, I used this Lumine Moisturizing and Illuminating Primer. Then the next thing I have is the Essence Camouflage Foundation and like I said in the Essence video, I freaking love this stuff and yeah, I'm using it every day now. So the next thing I used <laughs> is this um, Maybelline Age Rewind Concealer. Don't ask me where I got this from because I got it from China. I think they don't have these in Estonia. Oh, then I used this baking powder and for the brush I used this article brush. I freaking love this brush. It's my favorite. Contouring I used the Bahama Mama. It just does a very good job. Oh my god, it's so dirty! For the blush, I use this Kiko Duo blush thing. Let me try to open it with one hand! <laughs> so it looks like that. I usually just use a mix of both of these. For the brush, I have the Bourjois one that I just got for free um, from Kaubamaya. Because I bought that many stuff, so... <laughs> you know, shopaholic problems. So, oh, highlighter! For highlighter, I use this Makeup Revolution one. It looks like such a cheap thing, <laughs> but it actually looks so pretty. I'm gonna show it on my face later. Okay, let's move to brows. For brows first, I use this Anastasia, Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz, and this is in dark brown. Yep. To set my brows, I use this Pupa Eyebrow Plumping Gel. Eye primer, as always, my favorite article. And for the eyeshadow, I use this Bobbi Brown thingy. Looks like that, it has another drawer basically. Here, I use this two and this one here. For the brushes, I used an AOA one, which is $1, <laughs> and then a Bobby Brown one, which I, which was included in this thing. My favorite eyeliner at the moment is Turban Decay Razor Sharp Eyeliner for mascara. Of course, the Essence one, because literally, as all of you told me, this makes your eyelashes, I don't know, go to a universe. It really makes them really, really long and beautiful. Oh, then I actually wanted to show you my favorite um, lip balm because I know I have very dry lips and I know many people have as well. So this is one that really moisturizes them. It's the Blistex Complete Moisturizer. All over my lips, I use the NYX um, Soft Matte Lip Cream and it is in Con. So this is what my makeup looks like. As you can see, it has the little um, sa sateen, kind of like sateen, you know, highlight and a bit of contouring and the eyeliner I really like. And also you can see on my eyes, the mascara. <sighs> so that's about it. And now actually we're going to leave this hotel, but we're going to go to the next one a bit later. So first we're going to do some excursions, but we're going to leave this hotel first. I packed my things, kind of. That's my kind of packing, you just throw everything in. So today at night the worst thing happened and my phone didn't charge. So right now I think I have about 70% left. Um, because I wanted to charge in the morning when I noticed it. So I really hope I can still film everything and not run out of battery oh i forgot to show you my outfit of the day okay for the jacket i'm wearing again the forever 21 jacket but i also added this burberry jacket and for the shoes i'm wearing the new show sneakers so the question is do i ever wear something else than these no <laughs> honestly these are my favorite whatever again i'm gonna wear these you know Let's give the final glimpse to the bowl, which I didn't go to, but it's so pretty. Okay, do you want to hear a story about this suitcase? Um, this is the shittiest suitcase you will ever see, but why I have it is that we went to New York.
about the suitcase story. You know, I went to New York in 2000, 2013 summer and we went there with, without anything. We didn't even bring underwear, or socks, nothing. We just went and we brought a, an empty suitcase because if we buy anything, you know, we can put into things here. But we managed to buy so much stuff that the two empty suitcases weren't enough, so we just had to buy more suitcases and we bought like the the cheapest ones ever but the thing is that the suitcase i actually have a better one it broke the wheels broke so now i just gotta use the really cheap one but that's about it it's like an industry industry area industry area yeah. you don't have much here you just have the industry Feel the waves cut through me Hypnotized by the sounds I'm breathing in Hold tight, hold tight Chemicals collide Hold tight, hold tight, hold tight Dripping lights paint the skies All because of you like closer as you have seen touring the trip we have came to the places that are not that big and first you will you would thought like what's even special about these places and i thought the same but you know our tour guide also tells us the stories about these places and once you know the stories you will see the place through totally different eyes and they will kind of get the meaning for you and it's it's actually amazing it like this trip has taught me so much you know how to respect and love the small things in life you know it gives gives yourself some kind of peace so i think that's what i needed <laughs> and also the weather today is amazing look at the sky do you see any clouds Surrender it Hold tight, hold tight Chemicals collide Hold tight, hold tight Hold tight Dripping lights Paint the skies All because of you So some time ago this was a spa and this it is from 1100 years ago before Christ. So that's 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 a long time. And you can see the stones like glittering a bit. I think it's I actually don't know anything about stones, but I think it's like marble or something. So this is the antique toilet. Basically it was a social area where you talked with your friends and all the stuff. So, yeah, pretty funny how it was back then. But I forgot to mention 
was that they also had a gym here in this area so it was like a spa and gym combined I seriously don't know how it would look like but it is what it is so this is the kind of place where I'd really like to film a lookbook video or something like that but you know we don't have this kind of time It's called Kaya Artemis if anyone is interested. So okay, let me start with the... Oh yeah, and you also saw how we were rolled here. So it's pretty cool and just a bathroom. Mirror, blah blah blah, shower. Looks pretty nice and cute. Um, okay, what's here? Oh, okay. Wardrobe. Here you have the beds. This time I choose this more one. Because then I have the sofa as well. <laughs> so, this is what it looks like. TV, mirrors, lamps, nice selfie spot, and a balcony. And this is the main house. Again, it's like a complex. It has many buildings, and they all are like one hotel. But this is the main one. And where the reception is as well. So this is the corridor. And boom, we out. And I also got to know that uh, they have a spa here and the saunas and the pool is free. But you know what? <laughs> I didn't bring any bikinis. So basically this hotel is not in the town or in the city. So if it doesn't have any place I can buy bikinis, then... <laughs> I, uh, I, I just can't go, like, yeah, my life, like, my life in one sentence goes to a, goes to a beachy country, doesn't take bikinis, you know. So this is the hotel and it's really nice. I would imagine myself, like, drinking cocktails here and this side is so really good. And then on this side, these are all the things where the, all the rooms are. And the fountain and the pool back there. And yeah, it's really, really like really Greek style. So this is the like reception area. such a beautiful hotel but I just can't understand how you do a spa and you don't sell any bikinis and the hotel is so big and it's right at the beach and you don't sell bikinis like how? 
know. This should be such a simple thing, you know. You you have beach, you have spa. You need bikinis. <laughs> anyway, yeah. So I'm gonna buy some tomorrow when I go to the city. And yeah, so let's go there. So this is the name of the hotel. Um, you already did your cocktail, you also brought us nuts and stuff. And there you have snacks. But you have to pay like 5 euros and then you can take as much as well. And oh my god, I like this place so much. Um, yeah, I'm literally in love, but I just don't like that it's in the countryside. Because, you know, like I saw, I just forgot one thing and I couldn't get it from nowhere. That's just not a good thing and if, if you're bored, then it's not easy to go somewhere. But other than that, it's a very beautiful hotel and... Oh, I actually went to this bar and they told me they don't have any bikinis. I even asked, like, they have maybe some people, you know, have left uh, or forgot their bikinis there. But no, they didn't have even these. So... They actually gonna let me use like two towels, you know, to wrap myself around it and I can go to um, the sauna like that. <laughs> Ooh, I, I, oh my god, I just finished going to spa. I, I look like crazy, but seriously, I don't care. You know what I did? I just used my um, lingerie as bikinis, so I'm really proud of myself that I managed to do it, that no one really looked at me. Now I'm gonna take a shower and then we're gonna head to the dinner and I'm actually really excited about the dinner because, you know, it's a... I don't even know, is it a 5-star hotel or a 4-star hotel? Um, yeah, it doesn't say anything on the card. Either way, it's a very luxurious hotel so I'm excited what the, what the dinner will look like, but you will see in a second and I, I don't know what to wear! Oh my god, I'm so excited, I'm so happy about this hotel because the first one wasn't good at all. So, actually, actually not at all. It was good, but you know, I like these kind of hotels much better and I think you do do. Anyway, I'm gonna take a shower. Oh my god, look at this. It's all in orange. The dinner is somewhere there. So, you know, walking, walking, walking. Like always with the hotel complexes. Another one. Look what I have here under the table. Two. <laughs> here you have fruits and many different kinds of cakes. I'm so cold, so it's 14 degrees and I think I'm gonna go to the room via the internet because now I finally have Wi-Fi everywhere. <laughs> so, final glimpse to the hotel. Uh, 